All right, friends, welcome back to another one. Right behind me here is the wood that I just cut up for this video that you're gonna see shortly. But in my intro that I already did before I cut this, I forgot to mention how my job interview went last time because I left you off on a cliffhanger on the last video. So I got the job, but the bad news is um, they wrap up pretty much what they're doing at around three or four and I get out of school at 3.30. So I'm not gonna be like working there until school is over, which is in like four months. So in the meantime, I'll probably stock shelves somewhere and do something to get some big bucks coming in so I can pay off the truck. But uh, that is the news with that. I kind of expected that, you know, there's, they're not doing much when the sun's going down. So I fully expected that. So I'm not disappointed. So that's what's up. So here is the video. All right, friends, welcome back. All right, today we're gonna be bucking up some red oak. Yeah. Uh, let me flip the camera around and show you this thing. Uh, this is at the honey hole. We're back at the honey hole. Here it is. Pretty solid. We're gonna get the rest of this. It's snow covered and everything. I have to wipe that all off. Hopefully this is a solid log all the way through. Looks really nice and it's suspended up off the ground. I'm gonna have to, it's resting on a log that's sitting right there. So I'm gonna prop some things under it. And hopefully when I cut that pressure point right here, um, it'll just land on what's holding it up and I can buck it without bending over all the way to the ground. So I'm gonna get the saws warmed up and we will get bucking. Saw has not been started for a very long time. And uh, it's probably like 15, 20 degrees out so this is going to take quite a couple pulls <clears throat> gas already <laughs> all right I'm gonna go grab some gas
Well, that went really nice. Saw is cutting fast. So, now how do I get him out of here? <laughs> the place I gotta go to get it out of here is that red house you see in the background. It's pretty snowy, and I got a wheelbarrow, and it's slightly uphill. Uh, this is a lot of work. This is where uh, I wish I had like a riding lawnmower or some better way to get the wood out, but I don't. But this, it's gonna be worth it. This red oak is, oh, it's straight grain. Oh, it, it reminds me of Shibe's video. Just some nice red oak. And we got more after this too, another tree. So, um, I'm gonna crack them all out. We're gonna, instead of noodling, we're gonna whack them right in half because you'll see these rounds are just gonna, two wax, two swings and they're gonna fall right apart, so. Let me show you here. Oh yeah, look at that. Right apart. How about this one? Oh. Oh, this is a dream for me. This is so nice. This stuff is beautiful. wood is it's okay it's got about an inch of uh, rotten wood around the sides but for the center the center is good That was one swing. Look, this is done. Oh boy, here's the last one. It's pretty big. No problem. 
problem at all. All right, friends, we got ourselves a load. Uh, I would fill this a little fuller, but as you can see, my tires are taking a beating here. They need some air, it's pretty bad. So this, this is gonna be the last time I get wood until I get those tires blown up because uh, yeah, that needs to get blown up, obviously. The front one's even a little too, so. Uh, this was great. It's been a while since I cut wood. Um, and that's weird, especially since I just got this truck, but it feels nice to get back out here, even though it's cold and it's hard work. I enjoy it. We got ourselves a ton of nice, oh, look at this. This is beautiful. So we will see you back at the house. I'll unload this. All right, there it is. That was the whole load. Um, got the tires back up to 35 PSI like it's supposed to be. Um, this video is getting a little long now. So next video is when I'm going to be going out and bucking up that bigger red oak that's out there that I haven't shown you yet. It's, it's a lot bigger than this one was. So thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for the next one. We'll catch you later.